Alright, so today we're going to be looking for Mjolnir and the God of Lightning achievement. So, Mjolnir can spawn in a lot of places. And as such, I will find it. Apparently it can spawn somewhere around here, but I have not seen that. does have a spawn around here in this area here it can spawn here but isn't here this time it can also apparently spawn nearby here In fact, that shark can live up to 500 years. The, the Maonia can also spawn around here, down here, on this shelf. shelves on the right side are a good place to look as well. Ah yeah, here's where it actually is for me this time. Yeah, it was one of the spawn spots for it. We'll keep going anyway. Now there's a couple of attacks out that attack like can't unfortunately can't turn around when throwing it, which is really unfortunate. Yeah, there's a couple of attacks, it has a throwing attack like the hat. And just the standard Bonk. There are other locations for it inside, say for example, this area. As always, when visiting this area after you've completed it, you always want to swim down, don't activate the traps. spawn on the left side over here, near this divine tree root. It's playing my bay up in the corner, so... I know I'm low on bay, so... I should definitely pick up these jade marks. I don't actually know why it's displaying that, but... Weird enough. Now I'll pick up the, the jade stuff because I'm realise I'm actually low, running low. I think it's around here that it can spawn where I am now. also be found on this little shelf here. That's it for the three locations in this area. There's still more in the third glacial cave. So we're head there now. You cannot cut plants by throwing it, you have to hit it to cut plants.
It also has a knockback effect. As you can see, it just kept knocking back the poor Beagle Sharp there. The poor, poor Beagle Sharp got hammered to death. Now, I always like to go to the top route first if I'm swimming through here. And this little area here is actually one of the spawn locations it can be. On that where those sort of... I don't know what plants they are, or corals they are, but that's where one can be. It also supposedly spawn down in here. You can also spawn at the bottom of here. Oh yeah, it has. Hang on a minute. I'll use Molnir to free Molnir. Okay. Kind of weird. But yeah, as you can see, it can spawn there. Um, that's kind of a weird one. I use the stones to destroy the stones. I use Molnir to obtain Molnir. Uh, yeah, okay, that, that's um, an interesting mechanic. It's a feature, guys. It ain't a bug. It's a feature. Apparently, you can also spawn down in the control room, but I'm not sure if I necessarily believe that or not, but I'll check it out anyway. As if you search all those spots and haven't found it, maybe it is down here. Yeah, I definitely don't see anywhere where it would spawn if it was here, because there's not really much flat surface. Like, maybe it'd spawn there if you're lucky, but... To me, it doesn't seem like it actually has a place to spawn down here. Now that's half the achievement done, so you get me on here, sure, but you also need to kill a fish with me on here. So to do that, oh, this is good. This is good fish to target, I guess. Yeah, let me just throw your hammer. Well, that, although a bunch of the glacial area fish will be tougher than other fish. So, if you have the patience for it, you can also just go back up to some of the earlier depths, which I'll do. I'll cut to that though, because you don't want to see me swimming all the way back up. Also, post recording, I'm going to add in that apparently can't get the achievement by throwing the hammer, you have to hit them directly with the hammer. So you have to use your melee and not your ranged attack with the hammer. I'll try out this, see if it works. Mjolnir versus tube worms. Oh wow, I think it does. I hear it, I'm doing damage, but. Okay, maybe it doesn't work. But regular melee does. Also, if you're wondering, why is it pronounced Mjolnir when it's like got a J? It's because it's a soft J. You don't get that much in the English language, but in European languages, 
there are quite a few words that use soft chip J's. Back in one of my old jobs, a couple of companies that had contracts with the warehouse, they had um, soft G's, soft J's, and then like part, as part of their name. So it's like, it's not necessarily uncommon. As you can see, I brought my old Nero back up to the shallows. So... This point. As you can see how overpowered it is on these fish. So if you're really, really struggling with the achievement, you just bring it up here. Be a obliterating fish. Our law is never intended to be used like this. And I gotta find that fresher shark that everyone hates because, well, avenge people, you know? I also wanna see if I can bully him with the knockback. I'm here to bully you. Ah! Take that! That's just great, you can bully all kinds of animals with this. That sounds wrong when you say it out loud, but... Oh, you what's up too? Okay, this is actually the best melee in the game. Oh, I mean, you'd assume so much anyway. But first, like, the throw and attack is kind of janky. So... But the fact is, the actual normal regular melee swing is just so good that... It kind of doesn't matter. That was a big hit. Bullying fish in the shallows with Mjolnir. Absolutely terrifying. Anyway, back to the surface. If only Dave got to keep it. Yeah, that's about it for this video. Hope you have a good day.